Okay, good day everyone. So today, um, I will be handing out videos, um, a simple introduction to mobile application development in Xamarin. So first and foremost, you need to download the application. Um, uh, you just need to have Visual Studio for that. So first, um, you need to download this one. Um, Visual Studio 2019 or 2015 and later and you, you do not need to purchase this application uh, you just need to use this one the community edition you can use this for me I am using this one the community edition so once you download that um, it will give you this one so once you have it um, you will be having this one Visual Studio installer so for me I already installed it uh, I download uh, the executable program then install so once you have it um, here uh, it will show you different workloads so since I already installed Xamarin um, and, uh, and updated it uh, this will be your new uh, Visual Studio installer so if you already have Visual Studio and you need to add um, the Xamarin workload you just need to search for um, Visual Studio installer and then uh, hit more and then you can click modify so it will give you a lot of workloads that you can add to your Visual Studio so you just need to this one workloads and you just need to look for mobile development with that net and with the logo of Xamarin so you just need to put a chat you just need to check the checkbox and then click it will show you install here install then you just need to install it so once you install it um, you will be having this one so this will be your um, main screen for your visual studio so let's start with the basic um, first you need to go to file and then new and then you create your project so it will give you a lot of templates so you just need to look for our main um, our basic um, Xamarin so or you can also type in here mobile and it will show you mobile selections here so yeah, that one so here we will be using mobile app Xamarin.form since we are dealing with um, cross-platform development so you hit that one you can also use this one if yeah if you want to create a native native application for Android only or you can go with iOS if you want to create an iOS application but since we are dealing with cross-platform we will be the will be using Xamarin that forms so we can add it up with Android and iOS then hit next so your project name let's do it CSIT uh, demo and then hit uh, also please remember this one this will be your directory of your files this is where your projects your solutions will be saved and hit next or create then we choose blank since we will be using a blank application or we will be creating from scratch use that one blank this one blank application you have fly out this one fly out you have tab this one this is for the tabs and you have the blank an empty app with single initial screen then it should have this one Android and iOS then hit create
um, this may take some time a minute or two and later on I will be showing you if your PC or laptop cannot uh, cannot cope up with Android emulator on your um, PC or laptop you can just directly uh, deploy your created application to your mobile phone okay so this will be your main page you have here this one and service X server explorer rather and you have this one here you have your toolbar toolbar or a toolbox this one is your solution explorer and yeah it is installing the android sdk so you can emulate your application and this is your solution solution explorer this is your properties so and uh, you have three here you have the basic demo or this is the main one and you have the for the Android and you have for the iOS so you only need to code once and it will give you the end for the Android and for the iOS so let's start here main page uh, the XAML or XAML So this is your this is your XAML file. This is where you will be creating or inputting um, uh, your labels, your tags, your buttons. This is where you put it. And you have your toolbox. Okay, so in our slides, the one I gave you, you have um, you have this one, XAML, XAML, Extensible Application Markup Language by Microsoft. This is the example, and this is the this is the one. So this is the one, the example here you have linear layout I will be discussing later types of layouts and this one your image view this is how you put image and your text view labels I will be discussing that later on so this one so this is your XAML so you have label uh, you have this one and check sample output here this is your Android emulator and you need to create one before you can uh, before you can emulate it on your PC or laptop so I think this is about if you do it with Android emulator with Pi operating system or Android Pi I think it's 1 gig but I will be just using my phone so um, I will just uh, I will just show you how to how to add a new virtual device on your PC or an emulator this one this is Pi um, I think I will just use the Oreo since my phone is still under Oreo 8.0 uh, OS is uh, let's just use 8.1 and uh, just leave that the OS is Oreo you can also you can also use Pi if you want 
then you hit create so it will give you this one and you will be downloading still the same it's one gig for the memory so that's it that's how you and once that this is installed and created um, you can just do you can just click this one and it will give you the emulator once you have once you already created your app you can also open Android device that's this one so you just need to wait for that until it is finished so this is your XAML um, yes this one and we are using Android Xamarin that Android and we have this one the Android designer and this parts so you have the uh, this one number number two it is the toolbox or here it is the yes that is the toolbox for number one this is the one um, this is the Android designer uh, design designer window rather that's designer window this one designer window if we check that here it is this one so since uh, we still do not have the emulator it cannot emulate it right now so we'll just make an adjustments later on and um, you have this one the document outline if you want it's the, it, if you want to put that one you can go to here you can go to view other windows and look for document outline there you go there you can do that one that's the document outline and you have the source and the design um, here yes the source tab uh, the actual code of the XAML code yes this one but um, I think this is 2017 and mine is 2019 so if you want to get the source tab it is here source you click that one and you see the source code or the XAML codes and you also have these properties so here it is here when you click uh, this one when you when you click this tabs or when you click um, when you click a property it will show you its property here this one so this w here you can change the color um, the height the padding margin you can do it here on the properties tab and lastly you have this solution explorer so this one this is where your files will be at so you can put your files here this one your resources you can put your drawables here the pictures images you can put it here so that's it for the um, basic basic window of your visual studio so this will be a uh, multiple maybe a multiple video so I will be um, I will be sending it to you to the Edmodo so that's it for now so see you on the next video